The problem with corn chips that we buy in the store are that they are very high in fat and free fats. They're also high in salt and they are also very expensive. Even the baked ones contain free fat. Free fats clog the arteries and add pounds to your body. Here's a cheap, fat-free way to make corn chips that you can season with either less salt or no salt or with the seasonings I'll be showing you in this video. Each step is important to keep them from becoming tough, so keep that in mind as you watch this video. First, buy corn tortillas that have only water, lime, and corn in them. You don't want to buy any with all these unusual ingredients. Some of them have all kinds of ingredients that are not healthy, so read the labels carefully. The second part to remember is to put the package in the freezer at least overnight so that all the tortillas in the package are well frozen. Now while the package is still frozen, you take a knife, a table knife, regular table knife like this, and you break them apart. I'll show you what I'm talking about. You just run your knife under it like that, chip them apart. If you wait until they're thawed, it's a lot harder to do. Now, I've put some salt water in a shallow plate, about two tablespoons of salt, and you want to just dip those in there, and then put them in the oven. At this point, if you like something seasoned, you can use some of these ingredients. This is ground paprika, bacon hickory smoke style um, yeast. This one gives you a really nice hickory flavor. And the cumin. I've done all three. And what I'm going to end up with is something that tastes kind of like a barbecued potato chip. This is really good. And you just dip these in here. And then you're going to put them on the rack, same as the others. The next step is to put them directly on the rack in the oven. Set the oven for approximately 250 or lower temperature. You want a really low temperature so you don't burn them. They, they burn very easily. And you want to cook them for about 20, 25 to 45 minutes. The seasoned ones take a little longer to cook, so just keep them in the oven at a very low setting until they are crisp. And here's how they look. These are the unseasoned ones. And these are the seasoned ones. Almost tastes too good to be good for you. <laughs>